Let's look at how easy it is to wirelessly record and import video into the TPS software using the TrackMan camera app. First, you will need to download the app to your iPhone or iPad. Now let's look at how to wirelessly connect the iPhone to the radar. First, go into Settings. Under Wi-Fi, make sure that your Wi-Fi is turned on. From the list, go ahead and select your radar. Then once you receive the check mark, go ahead and exit settings and then open the TrackMan camera app. You can connect to your radar and if you receive a list of radars, just make sure to select your radar from the list. I'll connect to the radar and now we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and hit a shot. As you can see, the video is automatically imported into the TPS software, and with the iPhone 5S, I can record at 120 frames per second and 720 HD quality video. Now, if we want to import the video a little bit faster, let's take a look at the settings available in the app. Under settings, I can go from 16 by 9 to square video. I can turn off the high quality recording and I can go from 120 frames per second down to 30 frames per second. All of these will make for faster recording and importing of the video. Now let's go ahead and hit one more shot. All right, Nicholas, come on over. Let's take a look at those last two videos. So if we look at that last video, we reduced the frame rate down to 30 frames per second and then also the picture quality. We can go ahead and play that back. And then let's go back to the previous swing where we had full 120 frames per second and 720p quality video. As you can see, the video quality is very good with very little shaft blur. Now, we're gonna record one more shot where we introduce an iPad and have two devices recording at the same time. I've connected my iPad the same way that I connected the iPhone. Went into settings, chose the radar from the Wi-Fi networks, and then opened the TrackMan camera app. All right, Nicholas, let's take a look at that last shot there. If I go ahead and bring up the other camera angle, you can see that I have the HQ video on the right, which was the face on with the iPad. And then on the left, I have the low quality video that we took from the iPhone 5S. We'll go ahead and play both of these back together. Now the last thing that we want to show is we can also do a manual recording with the iPhone and iPad. So let's go ahead and get you to do that drill we were working on earlier. To use the manual recording feature available in the app, simply click on the camera icon in the app at the time that impact would occur. The app will automatically trim the video before and after and import it into the TPS software. Go ahead. On that last one, where we did the drill, you can see that there's no data at the bottom, and we have both views. I can play back the video. You can see the drill that you're working on. And so it makes it easy to record manually recorded videos and have them automatically import into the TPS software.